City Constrictors. Um, so I got this egg here and we are going to cut it. Um, what this is, is if you watched one of my other videos, I explained that I had a clutch of normals given to me, a clutch of eggs that came from a girl who had a normal um, male, or what she thought was a male and ended up being a female. So anyway, didn't have an incubator and asked if I could uh, incubate them and I said sure so there was um, I believe nine eggs and all but this one have gone bad uh, today is day 60 so I decided that I'm gonna go ahead and cut because it it's starting to look kind of weird and the last clutch I had had an egg that looked like this so I didn't want to you know take a chance of it drowning or anything so we're gonna go ahead and cut, cut this uh, egg anyway let me do this Get this out of the way temporarily. Put this here. Just make it easier for me. So honestly, you know, I don't know if this is uh, dead or alive. Um, hoping it's alive. You know, hoping there's one survivor. But being day 60, I uh, just don't really want to take a chance. So let's go ahead and cut this open and see. See if we have a an alive snake. I didn't actually see any veins left after a while on this one. There was vascular development for a while. And then... Alright, so there is a snake. Now, let's just see. Yeah, it's not looking good. If I were to guess, I would say this baby is not, is not moving. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, doesn't look like it's gonna move. So yeah, um, there you go. It's clutching nine eggs. This this snake obviously, you know, looked like it was pretty developed and it was moving in the egg for a while. Uh, but somewhere along the way, something went wrong with it. So anyway, there it is. Um, you know, thanks for watching. This is uh, unfortunately the uh, part that breeding. You know, us breeders, we uh, don't like to have it happen, but, you know, it's reality that things like this are going to happen. So, um, you know, something you got to be prepared for if you're going to do breeding. You got to be, uh, you know, you got to weigh your options and decide if, you know, you're going to be able to handle things like that. So, anyway, uh, again, thanks for watching. As always, check us out at Queen City Constrictors 704 on Facebook.com, QueenCityConstrictors.com, and subscribe on YouTube if you haven't already. Comment and like and everyone have a great rest of your day and we will see you soon.